My name is Fiona Miller and I'm a interdisciplinary researcher and interdisciplinary researcher at the University of Sussex. Today I've been presenting or trying to squish the whole of four years worth of research for my PhD into 15 minutes and that is looking at how audible frequencies might be affecting uh, the autonomic systems in our body that manage arousal. The best thing for me as like a you know, massive egotist was that uh, I got to play my sounds loud, which has only been in headphones and participants have been rolling in and out like 45 and I've not really been able to hear the sounds myself. Um, so that was fantastic to hear it loud and in a beautiful space, obviously not through the spatial system, but still great. I did the th something for the first time, I don't even know if it's been done before, uh, which is uh, to do a microphenomenology interview for, like a mass microphenomenology interview. Microphenomenology is a cognitive psychology interview technique which uh, wraps up loads of things from philosophy, uh, neurolinguistic programming, psychotherapy, and it uh, basically takes people through in minute detail, uh, backwards and forwards, their pre-reflective experience. So that's their unbiased experience. I will not know how that was experienced because it wasn't a two-way thing, it was something for people to reflect on for themselves, but that is exciting anyway. I get most of the time to talk to academics and scientists uh, and neuroscientists um, about sound and the effects on the body and today was the first time I've been able to talk to fellow musicians as I'm a musician kind of entering into the neuroscience world and people that really understand that the experience of sound is, uh, is vast and wide and has loads of opportunities and I'm not sure that always I'm presenting to people that care about sound as much as I do or know what the potential is of creating immersive sound experiences. From what I can see and the community that I've been very briefly involved with and lucky enough to sort of speak in front of, uh, there aren't many communities where we're talking about sound in this kind of multifaceted way and if we are it's quite heavily involved with the technology and lost in kind of the details of, uh, of, of, the, of the technology and the function if you like, but actually experience is kind of what drives us in the first place and wraps us up and, and, and makes us fascinated and so a community that's attached to experience and technology as opposed to technology and then of course people have experiences, uh, for me that's a really exciting place to be.